Hi, my name is Kai and in this video we are going to look at some of the new features in the ePlan platform 2022 that will help you to make the transition from previous version. So have fun with it and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. When you have opened the ePlan platform 2022, you will see that now we have the so-called ribbon technology and we have the dark mode and light mode, and, uh, but I think uh, all of this is already well known. Many people talked about this, but if you come from an older version, maybe you didn't find something here in the ribbons uh, on the beginning. And so there is a really nice function when you start with the new platform here on the right co top corner. You can click on your workspace and here below is transition help. And when you cl click on show menu bar, it opens here on the bottom line the old menu bar from the previous versions and you can see that for example here the utilities, reports and so on has the same view like in the older versions. So this is maybe really helpful for the beginning to become more familiar with this version. But on the long run I think you should skip this and work with the ribbons here. Maybe you see that, for example, here under the device menu, you have the different ribbons with different navigators. And when we have a look on, for example, connections, we have also some navigators. If you want to find all of the navigators, you just go to the menu view and here on open. And here you can find all the navigators in one go so that you don't need to search for it here in the ribbons or in the, in the toolbar. Another really nice function is the tell me what you want to do. Here you can just type in what you are looking for. You will get some suggestions. And for example, when you type in grid, you look for the grid. You can directly select here what you want to do and get shown all the functions connected with grid. So for example, here we can switch on and off the grid. This could be also very helpful in the beginning to find some functionalities. Another really nice function is here the Quick Access Toolbar. When we click here on the Quick Access Toolbar, we can click on Further Commands. And here we can add functions of the dip different tabs to the Quick Access Toolbar. For example, you want to call up settings. You just mark it here and click on the blue arrow. And here you can sort. For example, we put it on the end. Click OK and now you have the function here and with one click, for example, you can jump directly to the settings instead of go over file and then settings. So this is also something what helps you to become more efficiency and save time in your daily work. Thanks for watching this video. If you have further questions, please leave a comment below this video. Drop a like if you enjoyed and don't forget to subscribe and activate the notifications. Hope to see you in the next video, which I recommend you on the right side. Grow your e skills.